For the past decade, the House of Mouse has been busy bringing us adaptations of their beloved animated classics, and there's no sign of the live-action reboot train slowing down anytime soon. With some of Disney's reimagined classics being a hell of a lot better than others, we're excited to see where they take the studio's very first animated film, the 1938 Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Hello, and welcome back to Slurp! Before we jump into the video, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to keep up to date with all our latest content. And now, here's everything we know so far about the live-action Snow White. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, lift off! based on the grim, fairy tale of the same name. Snow White is one of Disney's classic stories to be told and one of the latest to be returning to the big screen in live-action form. The story tells the tale of a young girl living with her stepmother, the Evil Queen, who's threatened by her pure beauty. When a magic mirror tells the Evil Queen that Snow White is the fairest of them all, she orders a huntsman to follow her and kill her. Bring back her heart in this. I mean, talk about jealousy issues. But, the Huntsman can't face killing Snow White and lets her escape into the woods where she befriends seven dwarfs and remains happily until the Queen learns she's still alive and disguised as an old hag attempts to kill her herself with a poisoned apple. Snow White has been portrayed in live action over the years, including by actress Kristen Stewart in the 2012 Snow White and the Huntsman and also in 2012 Mirror Mirror starring Lily Collins as Snow White. But, the film was majorly unsuccessful at the box office, and that's the last time we saw a live-action Snow White on our screens. So, it's time for the House of Mouse to step in with their reimagined classic. Production for the movie has been underway since 2016, so fans are hyped for the release. The first look at Rachel Zelger as Snow White in her costume has been revealed. In behind-the-scenes shots, we can see Zelger on set in character complementing the classic costume design. With a blue bodice style top with long puff sleeves, a long yellow skirt, and the classic white collar. Compared to the original animated costume, there are a lot of similarities although the animated 1937 character sported short sleeves. As for accessories, Zelger is also seen to have pinned wave curls. And although the iconic red headband isn't present in the snap, with how iconic this is for her look, we can only guess this was added at a later time. But we think it's safe to say the Ugg boots won't be making an appearance. With the amount of hype building around Zelger and her anticipated appearance, there's no denying she looks like a picture-perfect princess. But the actress also recently demonstrated her insanely talented singing skills and charm in Steven Spielberg's 2021 remake of West Side Story, starring alongside Ansel Elgort and Ariana DeBose. With Snow White officially announced in June 2021, director Mark Webb said in a statement that Rachel's extraordinary vocal abilities are just the beginning of her gifts. So we can't wait to see what she's going to bring to Snow White. Unfortunately, Zelger faced a lot of backlash for being cast as the lead role, which she discussed on the Variety Talk show, Actors on Actors series with Andrew Garfield in January 2022. Never in a million years did I imagine that this would be a possibility for me. You don't normally see Snow Whites that are of Latin descent. You don't particularly see people who look like me or me playing roles like that. When it was announced, it was a huge thing that was trending on Twitter for days because all of the people were angry. We need to love them in the right direction. At the end of the day, I have a job to do that I'm really excited to do. I get to be a Latina princess. Well, we're with you on this one Rachel and we can't wait to see you on our screens as Snow White. Rachel is set to star alongside Gal Gadot, who is taking on the role of the Evil Queen. Best known for her portrayal of Wonder Woman, Gadda was cast for Snow White in November 2021 and recently teased a shot on her Instagram of her last day on set. While Snow White is set to hit our screens in 2023, we still don't have an official release date yet. But we can suspect to hear more details from Disney soon considering the Evil Queen has wrapped and left the building. 
It's also confirmed that American actor Andrew Burnap is set to join the cast as a new character named Jonathan, a love interest to Snow White we suspect. Burnap, 31, won a Tony Award for his role in the Broadway production The Inheritance. So we can't wait to see him star alongside Zelger. With Mark Webb, who previously directed The Amazing Spider-Man and its sequel, on board as the director for Snow White, Aaron Cressida Wilson and Greta Garway writing the screenplay. And not to mention award-winning songwriters Pasek and Paul known for the music behind The Greatest Showman and La La Land joining the talented crew, paired with Zelger's vocal abilities, we can only hope for incredible things. In terms of the plot details, we can expect the story to follow the Brothers Grimm 1812 German fairy tale Sneewitchen. Disney took a lot of its inspiration in its early content from the Grimm brothers, such as Sleeping Beauty, Cinderella, and Rumpelstiltskin. We can expect to see traditional elements from the original, like the Magic Mirror and Poisoned Apple. Snow White's friends the Seven Dwarfs are also expected to be featured although this has caused some disapproval. Game of Thrones actor Peter Dinklage, who has a form of dwarfism, criticized the reboot in an interview on Mark Maron's podcast in January 2022 saying, It makes no sense to me. You're progressive in one way, but then you're still making that thing backwards story about seven dwarfs living in a cave together. What the F are you doing, man? Following the podcast, Disney responded to the criticism and put out a statement that said, to avoid reinforcing stereotypes from the original animated film, we are taking a different approach with these seven characters and have been consulting with members of the dwarfism community. So it will be interesting to see what direction Disney take with these characters to portray them in a respectful way. Let us know your thoughts about these characters in the comments and what angle you think Disney will take with their representation. But, as mentioned we don't have a confirmed release date for Snow White. Due to the pandemic filming was delayed in 2020 and production kicked off again in March 2022. But again was briefly paused due to a fire that damaged the set at Pinewood Studios in London, England. With Gal wrapping up her scenes, which is rumored to include musical numbers, we can assume production is well underway and is expected to conclude in July 2022. But for now, we will have to patiently wait to see how Disney reimagine another one of their animated classics. Thanks for checking out our video. Let us know what you want to see in the upcoming Snow White in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. Thanks for watching. Can I say, don't let your heart fall down at